5.4 Mini running on my M4 Mac Mini Pro. It's the base model with 24 gigabytes of RAM and I've got QuickTime running on my system and what that means is some of the GPU is being used by QuickTime so this is going to give you an overall picture of how fast this model can work um, but if you then go and test these on your own system if you haven't got QuickTime running like it's unlikely you're going to be doing screen recordings you'll probably get slightly better performance so we've got Olama running up here I'm just going to go into the terminal and show you which version so it's 0.6.4 which is the latest version at the time of recording 5.4 requires Olama 0.5.13 so we've met that condition if you don't have or if you've got an older version of Olama then you'll need to um, click on your um, icon in the taskbar up here and there should be a, an, an update available right so I am going to copy the run command and I've oh, I've actually run this already so it will just open up for me if you're doing this for the very first time the first thing that will happen is it will download two and a half gigs worth of data so let's just we'll exit out and we'll do exactly the same but we'll do dash dash verbose and that's to enable me to get some metrics about how th fast things are being um, generated so this gives me the amount of time it takes and the um, tokens per second that are being um, consumed on the system to be able to produce a response to the prompt first thing I'm going to ask it is please provide please write 500 words about artificial intelligence okay so it's going to go off write me 500 words I think it's gonna be pretty fast um, and so this is uh, where well 10 seconds that's super fast I mean if I'm attempting to do something through some of the larger deep seek models so for instance the deep seek r1 I think it's the 32 billion parameters I'd expect that to take a few minutes to produce 500 words obviously I'm not testing the quality of the words so I can't tell you whether this is really brilliant 500 words but it's doing a, you know, a quick job of it at the moment so I'm going to next ask it to provide me with the lyrics for the Beatles song of me do I'm expecting this to fail in some way or other um, and that's because the training data unlikely it's been trained on copyrighted information oh okay so um, it's not going to do that right and Joe you know I think that's a really good way of tackling things that's outside its training model and especially if it's not got access to the internet just like take one second to say no this isn't my type of prompt rather than 10 seconds to come back with a, a whole load of gibberish so that's I think that's a, a, a good tick in the box for for 5.4 um, I'm going to ask it to generate three prompt examples to write to use with AI tools for the creation of Python scripts. Now, what I'm keen to see here is it understands the nuance is I want prompts and not scripted examples. And straight away, I mean, not only is it done it super fast, but it's actually understood that nuance. So I found in some of my other tests, if you watch other videos, that when I ask for this type of nuanced query, it 
thinks the smaller language models don't realize that what they want what i'm after is prompts and, and instead it gives me script examples which is not really what we're after so that's again that's another tick in the box here so this is so far three for three in terms of speed it's uh copyrighted information it's just going to say nope it's going at, like I say, at a rate of knots and also it's understood a slightly more nuanced request so um, what else can we do I'll ask it to provide me with the words from the poem if by Rudyard Kipling this is public domain and yes, it's done a good job of reciting that poem. It's done it in like super, super quick time. So really impressed with that so far. But what I am going to do is I'm going to open up a new terminal now. And I'll exit out of here. So unload the model. I'm going to open up a new terminal window. Keep this up here for reference and Instead of five four mini, I'm going to get five four running on this system. In verbose mode. Now, I am expecting this to go much slower because it's a far it's a 14 billion parameters is a much larger model but let's ask it to let's do a hello first just to get it warmed up and get the model loaded into memory okay there we go so let's take the first question of please write 500 words about artificial Intelligence. Okay, so as we'd expect, it's much slower, but it'd be interesting to see how much slower. So the 5 4 mini completed in 10 seconds. Uh, we've got a lot more GPU usage happening now, but the memory pressure is still good, so we're still well under the 24 gig of the whole system memory. And that's why I, I really like this Mac Mini is it's got a reasonable amount of memory. You can do reasonably complex things with it. So, yeah, sometimes you might have to wait longer than if you had an Nvidia GPU, but you know, that's, um, that's, that's a small compromise to make, especially considering if you're buying a 40, sorry, a 5090, RTX 5090, you're probably looking at the same sort of price as a whole uh, M4 Mac Mini Pro. Okay, so that's taken four times as long. Provide me with lyrics for the Beatles song. Let me do. Okay, well, it. This is interesting. So, actually, in the so five four mini, in my opinion, has done a better job here because it's not hallucinated the lyrics, and so it's actually twenty times faster than um, the five four because that's got that's twenty seconds of wasted tokens and wasted effort so that, that that's quite an interesting uh, interesting situation now let's ask it oh, let's ask it to generate so I'll try and find the words ah, let's generate three prompts examples to use AI 
is with AI tools. Okay. So again, as we'd hope, it's recognized that I'm after prompt examples and not code examples. This has taken just over twice as long. So finally, Rudyard Kipling. Again, I'm expecting it to succeed. There we go. But I'm just interested in the amount of time it takes compared to 5.4 Mini. So if the previous tests or anything to go, the, go by, this should take 10 to 12 seconds, just over twice as long. But we'll, um, we'll have to wait and see. Oh, 26 seconds, so four times longer. And I wonder if... Ah, that, that. Here we go. So, I didn't actually uh, take uh, too much time looking at what 5.4 Mini had done, but it hadn't, it only gave us an excerpt of if. So, the 5.4 has given us the full, the full text from the poem. What I found really interesting is how good 5.4 Mini has been how fast it's been and how it understands the nuance of the queries that I've been and the prompts I've been sending it. I'd be interested to hear what you think about it and also if you're into your AI and running AI language models and workflows on locally and privately on your own system and specifically on a Mac then have a look at this video over here.